Hey guys, I had this question recently. I had a guy commenting on our videos and he was basically asking, hey, you know, I've got zoning in my home. I've got three zones, but I have a humidifier and I'm wondering how to connect all that. I think before we even dive into this, I would argue that if you don't know what you're doing, you should probably call a pro. Whether you have zoning or not, when you're asking questions about, you know, adding accessories like a humidifier and things like that, I understand you can buy them on Amazon or wherever it is you purchased it, but I would argue that having a pro in there will help you avoid pitfalls like incorrectly connecting it to your zoning system and possibly causing more humidity issues in your home. That said, I wanted to do a video on this because I thought it was an interesting topic that we were going back and forth on and ultimately I will say that if you have zoning in your home and you're adding an accessory such as a humidifier or dehumidifier, I think the answer of how do I connect it or what zone should it run with and things like that, like this gentleman was asking, all depends on a couple things. The first thing is the type of system you have and the second thing is the type of home you have. What are each one of those zones service? Does one of those zones have more traffic than the others? There is a way to wire it, you know, when you're installing the humidifier for that humidifier to actually come on with all of the zones or at least send voltage to the humidistat allowing that humidifier to turn on when that zone calls. But depending on your home and your system, you might have it just call with one zone. So maybe it's an, a zone that you have had humidity issues in, maybe it's a more used area, maybe it's where your humidistat is located versus other parts of the house. And I think that all plays a role. But now we're starting to see systems come out that are communicating and the thermostats themselves will measure the humidity and turn the system on and off itself. And what happens is the air handler or furnace will have what we call dry contacts and your humidifier will be connected there and then your zoning won't matter because each of the thermostats will be able to communicate with the zoning module and tell it, hey, you know, I need you to turn on in my zone. I need you to open the dampers. And oh, by the way, the humidity is off here. I need a humidifier or a dehumidifier to be turned on. So again, it depends on what type of system you have. It depends on your home. I told this guy that he should probably call a pro because the answers to his questions, there's just so many variables. And obviously I don't wanna give him the wrong answer just based on what little information he's able to give me. I think you need to get a pro in there. I think you need to make a, an educated decision. And ultimately they could probably in 10 minutes do something that you may take hours to do and possibly still create a mess and have to get a pro in there anyway. So I hope that helps. Thanks for watching. Hit that subscribe button. We'll see you next time.